All right, so we're going to do this uh, slightly different unboxing if my cat is going to be um, willing to let me do this. My kitty cat here. Uh, and this is something that uh, we just started doing. Come on, cat. Get on my shoulder if you want. Come on. Um, we just started doing, this is a, a vegetable box. It's called Misfit Vegetables. I've never opened this before, so... What you see is what I see. So, oh my gosh, I almost dropped my knife. If, um, cat, you're making this difficult. If there's stuff that's bad in here, we won't know. Uh, Misfit Vegetables is no kitty cat. You gotta get down. You're not gonna cooperate. Um, this is like a subscription service for veggies. This is the big box. It cost us $35 and I think $4 shipping. Um, and surprisingly, we live in Ohio and it came from New Jersey. I thought it was going to be a little bit closer. Uh, so inside we have caramelized ginger and pear parfaits, a recipe. So they send you a recipe in every box. That's kind of cool. Um, I'm going to actually open this up, uh, put the box on the floor, um, ice packs that are Still pretty much frozen. Uh, and then I'm going to go ahead and drop this on the floor, scare my cat, and I got to wash everything anyway. So that is that. That's like a foam insulation there. I'm going to put my ice packs on the box. Um, inside we have, oh yeah, I should mention it's all organic. We have a bunch of organic parsley. Kale. Two bunches of kale. Um, green leaf lettuce. And this, like I said, it's all organic. Uh, I've never had this before. This is supposedly a, a batch for up to five people in a family. I think, uh, I mean, We're going to use it as a supplement to the frozen veggies we buy. Uh, two whole green peppers there, good sized green peppers. Um, I'm not sure what kind of squash this is. It kind of looks like a spaghetti squash. There is, man, there's some beets in there that look gorgeous. My son will be happy with that. Oh, look at that. A beefsteak tomato. Um, and now the, the reason why they call it Misfits is it's supposedly stuff that is too ugly for your grocery store. Here's a, a couple more beefsteak tomatoes. They're kind of firm, so they're not quite ripe. Uh, it is, what what is it? This one broke on the way here. Um, probably froze a little bit. It's uh, late October. Well, yeah, it's late October. Uh, here's another thing, a green leaf lettuce. I think these are gala apples. Man, there's actually a lot of stuff in here. Uh, that one's bruised, but that's okay. Um, I mean, considering how the stuff's in the box. Five apples, six apples. Some celery. Another squash. Three massive beets. Oh, I lied. Six beets, organic. Um, I've never been a fan of organic, uh, but I figure that by the time I buy this produce, it's roughly uh, the same or or a little bit less to buy all this for thirty-five dollars. Three white onions. The, each one of these is about a pound a piece. I can tell you that from doing all my, my culinary days. And I believe these are Yukon potatoes. There's a handful of potatoes, enough for a meal. So as a supplement, I mean, this is really good. We got some fresh fruit, uh, the beets. The beets are actually gonna go a long way because you got your, your beets here can, you know, you got your beets, you can roast them down, and you got all your greens. The whole beet is edible, so that is, that's good. 
onions, they're a staple. Celery, they're a staple. Uh, I think, um, actually, my biggest problem food on the table is going to be, um, well, okay, so this one might be romaine. This looks like green leaf to me, but this is probably a very young romaine. Uh, so the, the biggest thing on the table for me is going to be the romaine and using all the parsley. I mean, this is probably half a pound of parsley. That's a lot of parsley. Um, and to buy this it, locally for us, it, this would be five or six bucks. All right, so there you have it. That is a Misfits uh, organic vegetable box, the, the large box. I think they call it the Madness box. I can't wait to cook these because I'm curious. I can't remember what they are. Um, they give you they give you recipes every week um, online if you follow their blog and stuff. Um, you know, and I, this is something we started to do. I'll let you know how it goes. I'll follow up with this because uh, food is something that through Gamer Goggles is actually wants to do a lot more of. Anyway, thanks guys for watching and have a great day. Hi guys, meet the Nibbles. Who's gonna go down? <laughs> she just did. Decided not to go down my back, so we'll do this for her so she's comfy. Uh, thanks for watching my video, and I appreciate it. Uh, please, please hit the like button uh, and and share it if you you know know somebody who might be interested. And of course, there's always Twitter and the Facebook thingy, and soon I have a newsletter coming that'll be down there or in the link below. And my kitty cat loves that idea. Uh, so anyway, uh, there was one more thing. There was one more thing. Oh yeah, subscribe. Be a part of my community, our community. Let's make it grow together. See you guys at a con somewhere or a local store or if I'm driving through the country, maybe a game club. I don't know. You're not going to go knock down my camera. Bye, guys.